Today we're calibrating an LDT with our digital readout E405. Uh, the process will be the same for a load cell or a pressure transducer. The four interface buttons, menu, peak, reset, and alarms. First thing is to warm up your transducer for at least five minutes and then you want to flex it at least three times. Secondly, we want to make sure our meter or our readout is set. You scroll through using the menu button until we see input. Hit the peak button, it should read ratio. Hit the menu button again, setup. Should be 00 slash 25. This is automatic mode. If you already know your coordinates, your low and high inputs, then you would have it on 15 and then you could manually input the low, re the low end and the high end. Config should be all zeros. Filter should be 11100. The decimal point will vary. I'm doing a one inch LDT. I want three decimal places. These are the lockout menus and we'll get to that later. So I've got a one inch LDT. Now I'm going to capture my low end which would be not flexed at all. You hit the menu, so you see low end, hit the peak, and then hit the reset button, and that stores your low read. The menu again for high end. This is your highest pressure load or movement. Flex it, hit the peak button, and it shows the value. The reset button, and that stores your high input. Now we want to tell it what to read at those coordinates. Low read would be zero. High read should be one inch. So we use the arrows to move the cursor. One inch, menu to store. And now we scroll through until decimal point. Now I want it to read three. And we scroll through to reset. Next you would take your readings. And if you're more than one percent off, you can always go to your high read and adjust accordingly. That gives you, because you have much more room to adjust to get within 1% on the highest reading. Once you've finished calibrating your device, you can lock out your meter, go to lock one, the peak button, and change each number to one. In the standard E405, that's the only lock you would have to worry about. Meters reset, and nobody can mess with your readings. As you can see, fully pressed is one inch, out is zero.